What you guys got another video here for you now if you're running a NAS drive here and all of a sudden it's disappeared from your network tab and you can't uh, access it because it's just disappeared here so let's go into our network you'll see it's gone it's not here and even when you click on refresh it doesn't display itself you do have uh, other devices here where you can access it via uh, the online part here on through your browser as you can see I managed to get onto it here but I want to access my files so let me show you a quick fix here so right click on the bottom right hand corner the network icon and open up your network as you can see here change network options you should see your network card here just right click and go properties inside here you want to drill down to where it says internet protocol version 4 TCP IP then we want to go down to the advanced tab then go to the wins tab up the top and then down the bottom here just enable NetBIOS over TCP IP and then click OK. You will need to restart the computer and then hopefully your uh, network will suddenly be visible and you'll be able to see your NAS drive. If that doesn't work you can also try this. So we're going to go back down to the network icon, open up your network uh, tab here and then go into sharing options. Just make sure that you have got your uh, turn on network discovery and turn on automatic setup it will be in your private area here just make sure that's uh, enabled the radio button is in there and turn on automatic setup and network connection of devices inside here that should already be there but if you've just tampered with it it may have uh, been disabled just make sure that's on uh, so once we've done that we can move on to another uh, fix here so hit the network troubleshooting here and see if it can uh, determine where your uh, network device is and fix that issue for you. Obviously I've got no issue here because it's now resolved but if you're still running into issues I'll show you some other bits you can try. So you can see it's still not visible here. So what you're going to do here is come down to the search windows here, type in here control panel and then open up the control panel now if you're looking at the category area here you can just change it to uh, large icons go down to where it says programs and features then you want to go over to the top left where it says turn windows features on or off once you're inside here just scroll down uh, through here and you'll see it come visible in a second so you can see here SMB 1.0 CIFS file sharing support put the tick into the three boxes here all there will just suddenly populate click OK and then you want to reboot your system it will start to uh, do some stuff here just leave it to do its thing and then what you want to do after that is reboot your system and uh, hopefully this will resolve your issue so one of these should work for you if it does then you should be able to reboot just like I have we're going to go back in and uh, test now into the network tab here and a presto it's there and you should be able to access all your files just like so anyway i hope this one helps you out guys i hope this one resolves your issue my name is brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk have a great weekend and i shall see you again for another video real soon bye for now Thank <laughs> you.